Alright, hey there guys, Grey here, hope you're all doing well. I'm gonna carry on doing another part quick. And I do mean quick, because it's getting dark and I got stuff I need to do. But yeah, I wanna play more of this. I know I harped on about it for basically the entire last part, but this is really good so far. I'm blown away, because the amount of criticism it was receiving was just mind-blowing. You know? But yeah, it just looks like basically a 3D update of the old game. So yeah. Anyway, this is good fun. Here we go. It's the sage, and he's about to be a total dick. Uh, Luca? I guess I'll ask that girl over there. <laughs> that chick over there. What's up, babe? Hey, Swing. Nope. It was the 90s, Find you know. Your Gotta make a Wayne's World reference. It's nice to see you again. It's nice to see you. God, he's putting it on for her. You're very welcome. Aw. Wait, you mean this little girl is 200 years old? Little girl? She ain't that little. She's about your height, man. Grow up. Right, here we go. Oop, that's it. Talk to her, not next to her. Make oh, eye contact with her. You've been disrespectful enough as it is. Fascinating. Fascinating, because you're a chipmunk. Oh. Oh, never mind. I'll talk to him. Luke, there we go. Monsters have started invading villages. villages. There's your boy. I love his voice. I just do. You underestimate my intelligence. Oh, World he's doing it too. This palace with the water's own Definitely a feminist. Can't avoid insulting her. Mena grows ever weaker. That could you know, the crazy kind of feminist. You know the type I'm all about. From its place of his actions cause right. the balance of mana in this area to shift. Beast mm -hmm. are evil in the world is working to seal away the power of the mana sword forever. Mm-hmm. By defeating monsters. Too many jokes I can make wars. here. I lay off them. Alright. Looks like your sword regains some power from vanquishing the mantis ants. Booyah, dude. There are more hidden orbs with the mana power to revive the sword. Mm-hmm. Cool. Now what do I do? Gemma, I want you to keep an eye on the Empire. Cool. Fortress? Like the one that destroys the world in that fairy tale? Fairy tale! Now, that is a game I gotta play. I don't speak or read Japanese though, so not gonna happen yet. The one on the PSP was really cool. Alright, I'm gonna skip some of this stuff. I'm just gonna read it. I want to go slow enough that you guys can read it if you want to. And I'm enjoying the voice acting. It's quite cool, but... Yeah. Gemma, you should request an... Understood. I'll leave now. Cool. Head to the cave in Gaia's name. Thank you. There's a dwarf blacksmith. Oh, sounds fun. Also known for weapon-making skills. You should see him as the sword yep, becomes more powerful. Yep, he can. Cool. Alright, great. Let's crack on with this game. Sounds like he slammed that fucking door, didn't he? He's pissed off, I'm the hero, that's what it is. That's what he's put me down in the last part. Yeah. You wield the legendary mana sword, but its power has faded. You know, it's hardly better than a normal weapon. Be fair, up against monsters, I will take a shit sword over no sword, alright? I do not want to have to fight them with just my hands and my head towel, okay? Why me? Why? <laughs> Explain this. I don't have that answer, but... Alright. No problem. Where do I fit? You must huh? become a Doesn't sound like what I said. Hmm. <laughs> Me? That's yep. impossible. Oh. Eons ago, the ancients used their war machine, the mana fortress. Mm -hmm. It's not a fairy tale like you. As the battle Get raged and the world reached, yeah, the we knew that bit. Rebuilt the world, hoping. And here we are. Come on, mate. Just accept it. It'll go a lot quicker for all of us. You must restore the mana sword to she glitch. I wasn't watching. So where do I? You Dude, you already asked that. Hero. Oh fuck! Oh, uh, oh no! She's gonna give me the damn lecture again. Cut it out, lady. You're enjoying this. It was just because I was taking the piss at the start, wasn't it? I'm sorry. There we go. Thank God for that. Sometimes you just get stuck in a loop, lad. It's horrible. All right, there you go, seed. Get your fell. Oh, you love it, don't you? You're a dirty little seed. It's behaving now, so it's all good. Right, my head towel tells me I want to get on with this. What? The seed and the sword have now synchronized with each other. What does that mean? Don't know. Don't no care. In the nineties, you didn't need to know. It just meant good things. You found one of the eight palaces. Mm-hmm. I worry about you out in the world with only a rusted sword. Take all right, cool. Then the spear is much better for now. So, yeah. Thank you. Would you like to save the game? Yes, please. I'll save it there just in case. First, take Gemma's yep. advice and head to reach cool. Gaia's navel. Head south. south. 
Yeah. Alright, I got it. Weapons. Where are you at? Weapons. There we go. Yep, bumps it up to level 21. Right, we run for the hills. And lock her in. Ha 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 ha. Fuck with me with that long ass lecture, will ya? Uh-uh. Not this hero. Right, we're good. So yeah, we're going ahead. I'm trying to remember how the hell, because I always manage to miss that cutscene with the goblins, and I really want to see it in the remake. So, let me think. Where's it I gotta go? I think I gotta go to that castle and see that chick run off. Let's have a look. Not that way. Definitely not that way I gotta go. Ooh, and I can run. Oh yeah, and that's one really cool bit about the remake that I've seen, is that running doesn't just use up 100% of your energy right off the bat. The fuck has learned to pace himself in like the 20 or 30 years since, so it's all good. Bam! Yep, yeah, keep going till we level this fucker up. Oh, I didn't take long. I mean, to kill him. I'm used to him taking three hits, it's amazing how much difference that one point of damage can make. Yep. Bam. Die. Where's that mushroom? I know you're here. There you are. I'm loving the look of it. I know I keep on about it, but I am. It's a remake. I'm entitled to be happy about it. It looks really, really cool. See a lot of people saying, oh, it should look like this. And oh, it should look like this. And ah, oh, well, I'm Wankstain42 from the internet. And I, in my professional wisdom, think it should, you know, just everyone's an expert. But yeah, this is good. I don't get all the hate. It's a remake. Enjoy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, soundtrack's pretty cool. I've heard a couple of funny bits on, uh, well, not here, but somewhere. I cannot be asked to change over to cut through that grass. Unless there's a chest. There's no chest. We're good. Kill this guy. Come on, two for one. Aww, zero for one. That's way worse. How about when do 16? Oh. Kind of clear how that one did zero, though. There we go. They're both dead. No chest. Yeah, I love that you can change the item limit. 12 is much better than 4. In fact, some might say it's 3 times better. There you go, mushroom. Die. Die, die, die. Alright, we're good. Another mushroom. Whoa. His head came off. Jesus Christ. Came off again. How worrying. You should get that checked out, mate. But then again, you're about to die in 2 seconds, so... Yeah, probably not that big a deal. Thank you! Always love that bit. Just fucking shake it open and move on. No need for a key. Just fucking hammer it against the ground till it opens up. Alright, mushroom's dead. Oh, another one. You knock one down, another takes its place. It's crazy. Come on, let's knock the plant out. Surely. And I don't know why, but in this game I feel a compulsion to fight absolutely everything. Hopefully that will stop later on down the line so I don't, you know, waste my time grinding against lower level enemies. But I'm an RPG guy, I love grinding. It's fine. It's all good. Right, now. Ah yeah, this place. I can never remember the names of all places, but yeah, this was Pandora, wasn't it? I'm gonna head to the castle quick, I wanna get that chick out. And then I wanna see if I can find that fucking cutscene. I gotta check out the cannon travel at some point as well. Love that thing. What a sophisticated way to travel. How do you land? Well, we haven't figured that bit out yet, but we don't have cars or bikes or anything, so that's what we've got. We don't even have horses, all right? That's how primitive these people are. Digging the purple hair there. All right. Get moving. Where you at, lady? I know you're here. Ah. My eye. Hair's at that awkward length. I trimmed it back a little bit the other day at the front. There she is. But yeah, it's still in my eyes. My not as long as hers, anything. though. I'm in charge of my life, not him. All right, her voice a little longer. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Hit her with the spear. No fucking way. Did I say spear? Spear. Stabby thing. Knock her the fuck out. You do not smack people when you try to get by. You ask nicely and politely. It's just general good manners. So yeah, not only is this place primitive as fuck, and they let boys run about, banished from villages, wearing towels on their heads. I'm sure that's a bit racist, but I'm not sure. Well, you know, I, I'll think about it, you know. But yeah, this is a crazy place. They don't teach common courtesy or good manners. 
or even basic training for the kid they're sending out into the world with nothing but a rusty sword, you know what I mean? So many problems. See, these are the issues, people. Not the fact that the polygon models don't look quite as sexy as you had in your mind when you heard the word Secret of Mana Remake. No, no, these are the real issues. Right, let's have a look. Where am I? Wrong place, that's where. Yep, I don't go here. Not for a long fucking time to come, I think. But then again, like I said, I've only completed this game once, and that was using the walkthrough. I was just going through with a picture walkthrough, just going note for note, so I don't remember anything about what I've actually got to do. Oh, and those will love this damn game. Right, keep going. There we go. Good music, that's gotta be it. Ah, uh, that went through him. I know he can take his head off, but come on. Ah, uh, yeah, and we got that weird Buzz Bomber type monster. So, yeah, we know we're on the right track. Ah. Get back, you devils. You dead yet? No. Poisoned? Poisoned is not good. I didn't even get that fucker's name. So for now, they're buzz bombers. Right, I got plenty of candy, so it'll be alright. I think like five or six. Not four. Definitely not just four anymore. Ha <laughs> ha. Rabbit's dead in one. I think those guys are dead. Yep, he dead. How did that not hit the one right in front of me? I hate those buzz bombers. They're so annoying. They take forever to kill. Ah. Die. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Oh yeah, I remember that. Doing that weird animation where it takes forever. Buzz B. That's close, you know. I'm calling them buzz bombers. Fuck them. That's what you get. I don't like you, so you get a fake name. Deal with it. I'll find a save point at some at some point as well. Oh dear me. I nearly felt a joke coming on, but that would be a bad fucking joke. Right. Yeah, it's the only problem with this game, because when I do uh you know playthroughs and that, I like to be able to save it when I've ended a part, so it's nice and clear and whatever, but uh yeah. This game's not gonna be like that, because you got the regular old saving at certain points in the game, like when you're hitting in or something like that. There is an auto-save, which is kinda cool, but I don't know exactly how that works. And I don't want to find out. Right. Ah, don't do that. <laughs> I'm tempted to test out the charge attack. Yeah, I'll do it just for the hell of it. Let's see. Come on. Let's go. That it? Does double. It's alright, but. Yeah. Booyah, you dead yet? Come on. Oops, I soon will be. Alright, always a critical on the last fucking attack. Hmm. Damn game's trying to fuck me. Bad game. Keep it clean now, game. This is the internet. Found candy. There we go. Much better. Booyah! Alright, mushroom again. And again. Let's just notice they got purple heads. Uh, keep it clean, game. Do not hand me a bunch of smutty jokes. We do not need that. The internet has plenty of that. Did I hit that guy? Never mind. Oh, two purple headed monsters. Troubling times. Come on, the guy's like 14. Keep it clean. Alright, one's dead. Easy. Easy. Calm down, man. No need for the backflips. I'm loving how they've animated it all in. Like I say, it's just basically a shot-for-shot -shot remake. With a 3D skin. What's not like? The original game was perfect. And yeah, it's got its flaws, blah, blah, blah. I keep going on about it, but... It's still awesome. Games don't have to be perfect to be enjoyable. We expect too much, I think, as a community. We definitely do. Nothing wrong with just playing a good game. That's its own reward. Bam. Get up, you monster. You're a man or a mouse? Or a bee? <laughs> Come on, Rabbi. Oh, I let him have it and he fucked it up as well. Yahoo's, yeah. Right, okay. Yeah, I think we just go straight up and we're done. Have a quick look about. What's that say? Guys, Naval. Kibble Village. Ooh, I want to check out the village. See if that guy dropped chest. He didn't. Let's check out the village. 
Do, do. This is Kipo Village. Yeah, the sign told me that. Thank you. Friendly though. Hey, he dances! Yeah! Alright, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna save. And we're good. This is terrible. Ooh, we got cutscenes now. I should never have followed Elliot and Timothy. <laughs> he looks so sad. Doesn't even have the energy to move his lips to talk. And yeah, I'm gonna take the piss for the rest of the game. That does seem lazy. I'll be fair to some of the negativity I've seen reviewing this game. That does seem quite lazy. I mean, how much money and effort does it take to make lips go when he's talking? You will be fine. Oh. Luca? Wait, where's your voice coming from? What's up, baby? You should know better. I'm always there with you. Always? You didn't see what I did in that bed during the night, did you? Are you protecting me? No, laughing at you. I will protect the one the Mana Sword has chosen. She should be taking the piss out of him. He's asking for it. Chosen? So, does that make me a hero? Hell yeah! Like the legend? <laughs> we just, there it was. I heard it. I'm sure I heard a little bit of laughter. You have a nice ring to it. Well, a hero can't be seen with some rusty old blade like this one. Oh, she makes it look more badass. If it makes you happy, I'm glad you have a purpose now. <laughs> Lighten up, Luca. Things will work out. You're the one being a bitch! I've got you watching my back. Oh. You don't disappoint. Oh, I will. Don't get me started, I will. Right, get in the damn bed. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to vary up the part lengths for this one, because it doesn't... It'd be impossible to make it fit nice and neatly for the 20 minute mark every time. So yeah, let's have a look. I'll keep going for a bit. But then, yeah. Save, damn it. There. We're good. I love it, he's just dancing. I remember on the original bit, trailer or whatever they showed, he wasn't doing it, and people were like, no fucking way. But yeah, they brought it back, so that's all good. See? Game companies do care. The important things, like whether the barman... Barman? Yeah, why not? Whether well, the barman dances or not. It's very important. Super important. And be fair, you know, it's pretty memorable. You want him to be dancing. Right, here I am again, fighting. For no fucking reason. Oh, gimme, gimme, gimme. Candy. I love how there's just candy lying about everywhere. I wish there was monsters out and about in the streets that drop boxes of candy for me whenever I went out. Then if I leave the house, it's normally to go buy candy, so would be a bit redundant, I guess. Probably a more fun way to get candy, though. You know, who likes paying for it with money like a fucking chump? Oh, well. You dead. Here we go. We're here, Gaia's asshole. I think. Lullabout. Right, I gotta get down there. So yeah, I'm gonna try to avoid just fighting monsters needlessly. I'm gonna get plenty of training in as time goes on. There's gonna be plenty of chances for grinding, because Christ, you have to to make the magic level up, but there you go. I feel very defensive about that, actually, just, yeah. Those are all problems with the original game, not the remake. People criticizing that need to remember that. It was with the original game. Still a brilliant game. Games don't have to be perfect on all fronts to be good, people. Again, I'm just that happy that they bothered to do a remake at all. I love it. It's fucking great. These guys I can kill quick. Later, fucker. Right, I think I'll go, yeah. I think I'm going the right way. So I'm, ooh, I can kill you quick, then. Yep, no problemo. Down. The hell are they fighting? There's only the two of them. Alright, you don't have to wait for them to get all the way back up before you can twat them again. That used to fucking piss me off on the original game. It was annoying. Right, run for it. There you are. There's two of them. I'm not sure which one I got going. Hey, it's our buddy, Nico. Don't kill him. We like him. Her. It. Come on, talk. Now, what a strange place to bump into. I didn't try to murder you and steal your stuff. Deal for busy save. Yeah, we'll save here. Screw it. Thank you. So yeah, again, really good fun playing this. I'm really loving it. 
I'm looking forward to more remakes, and yeah, definitely, if they're gonna do the fucking second one, that would be awesome. Can't remember how to pronounce it in Japanese, but yeah, we could do with an up-to-date version of that with proper in yeah, definitely. Anyway, I'll stop it before I get rambling about that, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this part, I hope to see you in the next one, and yeah, take care until next time. Bye!